Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. I'm Oren. I'm Kailaris. And tonight we are back to Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. And as always, I am super excited and ready to go. I love this game. It's so good. Um, so I believe this is part nine in our Jedi Fallen Order um, series, uh, which I gotta come up with like better names. We should like we should like watch them and be like, oh, okay, and this is Return to Kashyyyk or something. You know what I mean? Like rather than part nine. I don't know. But anyway, uh, hey Raccoon. Excited to see you in chat. Gotta say, Raccoon just, I mean, support for Raccoon is just killer. So good. I just saw the episode on Grey's Anatomy, Derek died. <laughs> and Kylar's is like, spoilers! Hey! Hi. hi, Mom, how's it going? What is going on? Excited to see you in chat as well, hey! So, uh, tonight we're going to hop right back in. I think um, last uh, we played, we were in the, like, what, what was it? The Shadowlands or something like that of Kashyyyk. So, crazy plants trying to eat us and, and, and things like that. So, um, so I think we're going to hop over into the game and, uh, and get going. Let's load. You look really low. I look really low. Yeah, my chair is not <laughs> going up high enough. I'm wondering. I'm wondering if I either need to like de like reduce the size of your like screen box there or yeah. increase mine. Yeah, you look miniature. Should I reduce yours? Mm -hmm. How about more like that? Should show up in a second for you. This is the way, Murph. This is I didn't the way. watch the trailer yet. Yeah, I haven't I seen do. it yet. <laughs> love that baby Yoda. Do love that baby Yoda. As I've said several times before, when I first saw Baby Yoda in that initial episode, my initial my my reaction was Okay, cheap trick. You know, like are they really gonna go there? Cause you know, Yoda, besides Yaddle, like little glimpses of Yaddle in the prequels, you don't see Yoda's species at all. He was meant to be ambiguous. You don't, nobody really knows of any others. And then they throw in baby Yoda, but that's almost the, the if they play it right, which I feel like Favreau is, it's, it's gold. You know what I mean? Because we don't know that much about them. So. Oh yeah, something soda is, uh, I know is coming. What are those gross things in front of you? Something exciting is coming. <laughs> what the heck was that? <laughs> I it uh, kind of looks like a pile of quivering snurt. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this part, this is where the fun begins. Oh, good. That seems ominous. Yeah. Murph, Raccoon, how are you guys doing tonight? Mom, what is going on? Um, so, uh, we will see what's next here. I th think I went over there. Take a look at the map. Looks like our objective is over here, but we can't just go there. What, what am I supposed to do with that? Oh, when I got close, it, like... Uh, while Kashyyyk is such a drag on Battlefront 2, it's amazing in this game. No doubt. It's been very challenging and a lot of fun. Um, and, and Kashyyyk in Battlefront 2 is my least favorite map, by far. I don't mind it one bit. I, I like Kashyyyk in all the Battlefront incarnations that I've played. The further you go, the better it gets. That's all I'll say. Oh, good. Yay. And by better, you mean... <laughs> you know what? I don't know if I have been over there. I'm going to go over there really quick. Famous last words. <laughs> Oh, 
why that sink in like that. Boing. It's what it do. Skill point acquired. Yes. Uh, speaking of snurt, um, the uh, the snurt video uh, on Twitch, the VOD, um, after 24 hours was already at like 96 or 97 views, which I mean, maybe obviously for some other streamers, that's small potatoes. But for us, it, you know, that is amazing. Like, I was so excited to see that. Um, and, and while, again, I was a little disappointed with the quality because the test the night before was the image was clear. It wasn't pixelated. So I've got I've got some ideas for the next one. We're going to try something else. And um, and I think it'll be even better. So um, but besides that, I, it was a great time. We had a great time. It was really fun having my parents over and doing that on stream, talking with them, having them help cook. Uh, it was kind of a family, you know, it was, it was, it was a really fun, like Sunday afternoon family gathering for us. And then to share that with you guys and to eat some really delicious food is like, it was just a great day. Cow's tongue. Hey, you get enough points, mom. I'll, I'll, uh, I'll make cow's tongue if you redeem it. Yes. Okay. I have been up here. It's like, then we'll add a redemption that someone can redeem for yeah. her to try it on stream. Oh, Dathomir's uh, raccoon's least favorite map. Oh, okay. Okay. Ooh, yeah. Tacos de, de lengua. Is that it? <laughs> yeah. I mean, we make cow's tongue. Maybe we'd have enough to, you know, make it the Dutch way and, and the uh, tacos way. The tacos way. This is the tacos way. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay, let's see here. Okay, everybody. I feel like this is turning into an every <laughs> flavor beat flavor redemption. Let's like keep it real. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it, it is going to be a collaborative thing too. So we yeah, um, we have to approve it. Yeah. I don't want it to turn into the let's see what we yeah, can it's, dig yeah. up and make them cook and eat on stream. Yeah, it's it's not going to be Troll USA, but um. But, uh, or troll international, <laughs> but I will say we're fairly adventurous. I will say to a modest degree, I'm, I'm advent, I'm more adventurous than Kylaris is. And yet she likes a broader range of things than I do. I don't know. I'm not picky, but I'm also not that like out of my way adventurous. You guys, how do I get over there? There's something where I can go around. Well, the Orin method would be to jump off something and fall. Right. Yes. Yep. What are chitterlings? Wasn't that a, a movies from the a movie from the fifties with some kind yeah, of? Yeah, with Chitty Chitty Baby. Oh, okay. <laughs> what? Uh, okay. Whatever. I'm just. I'm gonna swim. Oh, that was in response to pig intestines. Named them that. That's fair. Okay, we're gonna wait a second because that one looks like it paths that way. If I can fight just one at a time, that would be great. Ah! Gotcha! I hate these things! I hate these things, I hate these- Oh, I'm stuck on this, I'm stuck on this. <sighs> That's what we call them down here, a delicacy for some, a dry heaving nightmare for me. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds yeah. delicious? Oh, what a jerk. I don't think there's anything that I would consider like Oh, that's a delicacy that I am super into. Anything that is in that category, I'm just like, eh. I'm not sure why people like this. Bunch of she labs, these fighters. <laughs> Ungolian. Uh, Spawn of Ungolian. Light, his lightsaber is glowing what? blue. Stim BD. Yeah. Like some evil spawns of Angolians. Yeah. 
So I thought last time I fought these things, I could like catch these things off guard after they like rushed. And I'm definitely not doing as good of a job this time. And have I mentioned I hate them? Mm -hmm. Wanted to hit that one in the back. Help, BD. I should have hit that one in the in the, the tail end. Okay. Oh, you jerk! Your mom said try hitting them from behind. Yeah. yeah. She's into it. Great Spider, she who endeared herself to Melkor so that she might wreak havoc on Arda. Come on, what the heck? Out there for a second. Yeah. <gasps> Used almost all my stims just on these two guys. That's promising. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you have to swim. I mean, I'm I'm way behind. and try spinning that's a, try spinning that's a good trick <laughs> all right let's see here go over this way first oh another dumb thing to fight you're making it sound like you really enjoyed this game i do i love this game it's so good i hate these these are dumb i hate everything <laughs> Pick up your copy today. <laughs> they basically should make me an ambassador for this game. You have to go underwater to continue. Interesting, because I don't have underwater yet. Still? Is it going underwater? Okay, day. Ah, interesting. Very interesting. I want to respawn those spiders, but I also really want stim packs. And oh, oh, nope, that wasn't meditation. The retreating partisans were ultimately rescued from Imperial forces by the Wookiee chieftain Tarful. What? Fine, Tarful. That's fair. Lung plant. When threatened, the lung plant fills its body cavity with air to appear larger. If a slag still tries to graze on its leaves, the lung plant instant re instantly releases the air, uh, the held air, to force it back. I hear you, BD. Let me see. 
Interesting. Very interesting. all around this place up 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 the stairs we go and then we come to the tunnel and once they goes in there's no coming oh uh, there was a special connection between the wookies and their forest yep Let's check out this area. If I have to fight more spiders, which I probably will, I'm going to be like, uh. There we go. That's where we're supposed to be, Tarful. You do have to go off. That wasn't me just be uh, being silly. No, no, I figured. It was both. It's fair. Oh, that Murph, multi-talented. Where am I going from here? Hold on, what's like? Oh, yep, I see it. Hey, look. Glad you made it. This is Chieftain Tarful. I'm on a mission from Master Eno Cordova. He was looking for a Zepho artifact. Finding it could help save the Jedi. Cordova found wisdom at the top of the origin tree. You should seek answers there. It's massive. I don't even know where to start. Well, you might be able to find a way up through its root system, but most of it's underwater. You'll need this breather. <gasps> Murph, I finally got it! Thank you. What will you all do now? The only thing we can. Keep fighting. Good luck. Hope we meet again. Multiple entries. Uh, after a talk from Grease and Cal, uh, Cal and BD set off to find Mari and Tarful. While Cal was fighting the Brood, Trilla led an attack to destroy their resistance. A rift formed between Mari and Saw, splitting their forces in two. Saw had since left the planet. After fighting their way through the recaptured refinery, Cal and BD met Tar uh, Mari, Tarful, and Choisik. Tarful told Cal to climb the origin tree, and Mari gave Cal a breather to help him get there. The two groups parted ways. Now Cal must climb the origin tree. Done. Bro, <laughs> what? Kind of cool little lanterns there. That was the how to say it in Sherbrook. Oh yeah. All right. Let's check of the map. Down and under. Cool. It's in Australia. Oh, wait. Wah, wah. Oh, I, I see it. I see. That's cool. Can't go back. Oh yeah, for sure. Take a look. New lightsaber switch acquired. Peace and Justice 2. Nice. So, here's the deal. I'm thinking... Oh man, a whole nother area for me to explore. I'm thinking I should go rest and get my stim packs back. 
before we go uh, any further underwater. Tons of chests underwater, so I'll always be looking on every planet. Yeah, because you won't need to kill all those spiders again. Just stay underwater. Yeah, for sure. All right. And I think there was something else that only required one skill point. Two, two. Could have already gotten it as well. Yep. Okay. Everything costs two or more. That's cool. I am so excited to have this ability now because wasn't it was it Zepho Murph that you were tell, telling me, or was that still Kashik? I think we were still on Kashik where we were in that lake where um, uh, where we were in that lake where you said there were a ton of chests in there and I couldn't get. It might have been Zepho. It was the crashed uh, Zepho, yeah, with the Crash Republic cruiser. Yep, read my mind, buddy. Oh, you can go fat. You can kick to go faster. This is so cool. This game, I mean, for real. Talk about so fun, am I right? Awesome, awesome, awesome. You know how I like to explore. Like, I have a hard time not checking at every nook and cranny here right now, you know? There's that chest. We already got it. I think, I think that's the way we need to go to keep moving on, which I can't check my map. I believe that was the same chest. I can go back and look, though. And I'm okay with going back and looking, because I don't want to miss anything. What's that for you? <gasps> no, it wasn't! That was a different one! Thanks, Murph. Murph, you always got my back. Electrum plated. Cool. Oh, the other one was right there. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. So I'm wondering if that's to move on or that. I'm thinking that way. So I want to check this cave a second first. Some of these metal colors for the lightsabers are questionable. Really? <laughs> cool area. Aw, oh, poor Wookiee. The Wookiee took shelter here, mourning the loss of an elder. The Wookiees mourn the loss of someone close to them here, an elder known for their wisdom. It doesn't appear that anything else is around here. You should totally get the pink one. <sighs> yeah. Now, me is not liking this. Oh, hey, there's another chest. So I'm assuming, too, you can't fight anything in the water. Duralium. New lightsaber. Yeah, I can't activate it. Activate my lightsaber. So, so then... Do you not come across any... Uh... Any enemies underwater, then? And BD totally had something to scan over here, and now... Was it the fish? we're swimming by. Woo. 
So I love underwater stuff. Kyler in games. Uh Kyler's does not. Barf. <laughs> There we go. In it. Nice job. L A A T I, the low altitude assault transport, also known as the Republic Attack Gunship, was an armed troop carrier used by the Grand Army of the Republic during the Clone Wars and in the early years of the Empire. Maneuverable and formidable, it provided troops the ability for quick deployment and extraction in heavy combat through extensive types of terrain and climates. GG! <laughs> Thanks, Raccoon. Cal needs to sing a whole, new, a whole new world since this whole underwater deal is a new experience. Yeah, absolutely. Wait. A whole new world. Dazzling places I never knew. Or something. Oh, I can't swim in there. Punks. It feels a little clunky, like you get caught on a whole lot of things. By the way, thank you for singing Jasmine's lyrics. I You're welcome. Edits. You're welcome. Goes with your pink lightsaber. Right. A yup. Anything here? <sighs> Every little rock. Oh, you guys, this is so fun. I love this. I actually, um, I took scuba lessons when I was 16. And I uh, had a lot of fun with it, almost got certified, and then my friend who I was doing with, uh, doing the lessons with, um, his dad sold his boat, which was kind of our plan, right? We were going to go scuba diving off the boat. And uh, sold the boat, and, you know, um, scuba gear is really expensive, especially for a 16-year-old, even though, you know, I had a pretty good job for a 16-year-old, but... Um, Uh, you know, uh, didn't do my last dive and didn't get certified. And I'm like, why, you know, I'm sitting there thinking, why was I so stupid? I, I could have gotten certified and that would have been, I would have had it. <laughs> this guy's a punk. Man, you gross. You gross and slimy. Not even Tarful could keep them out forever. They won't stop until everyone's wiped out. What a cool environment. What's this? Sava. Capable of extending toward prey within reach or close contact. Resistant to laceration, including lightsaber. The Sava is a snake-like flora primarily located in the Shadowlands of Kashyyyk. Parasitic by nature, they are capable of slowly extending the length of their body toward prey within reach or close contact. 
Their vine-like skin is resistant to any laceration and upon con uh, contact, <clears throat> excuse me, will attach itself to a host, supplying themselves with nutrients for months or sometimes years. They are slow at expending, expanding and quick to retract at any signs of danger. Okay, so hold on a second. Is there anything else here that I can do? Kind of doesn't seem like it, but I don't like to miss anything. wondering if I get down there. Okay, I see what I gotta do. In. Go far enough, come on. Yes! With this, you and I are gonna be unstoppable. What, another yeah. one? Seven! Seven stim packs! Awesome. So cool. Okay, and that's where I gotta get back to. that they're incorporating the rebreather from um, the uh, prequel trilogy too. I, I always liked that part of the movie. Y'all are uh, y'all still working on ditches from Sunday? We have a little bit. We actually we got everything yeah. pretty cleaned up um, afterwards, uh, but um, there's still a few of the, you know, like the big pot and stuff like that that needs to go in. It's scrubbed. It just needs to be like run through the dishwasher. Oh, you punks. Go, go, Cal. Go, Cal. Go, Cal. Go, Cal. Go. What do you say, Allie? Nothing. Yeah, you did. She said, yeah, I think. No, I can dirty up a kitchen in a heartbeat, but cleaning up, ugh, don't make me, please. <laughs> I actually don't, like, uh, like I think I said during the Snurt uh, stream, I don't mind um, cleaning. Oh, this place just wants to kill me. Those things give me the creeps. Me too, Cal. How do I go? How do I go down? Strong words coming from you. How do I go down? Okay, let's look at this first before we do anything else. We need to get over there. I think I can hit A and drop. I'm gonna get I'm gonna use a stim pack. I owe you one. Um I, I tend to like to um to clean like while I'm cooking. So that What what? Aren't I able to drop or do I gotta find a way around that? Uh so that way when you know the meal is done, there isn't much left to do, and I can just relax. 
Why can't I go past this? Drop and regrab. Hmm, that's fair. Yeah, it does. De it does depend. On oh, don't leave an ata. <laughs> it does kind of depend on um, what's all involved, right? Like if you don't have time. I'm, it's not giving me the option. I'm hitting buttons, man. Mind helping me out there. Nice job. Huh. Maybe try to jump where you land on the wall beneath the root. I don't remember hitting that snag. Gotcha. Yep. I will try to do that. Nope. It it makes me want to grab that right there. No, oh, it's cool, Murph. Don't worry about it. You are definitely helpful, sir. Watch. There's like a rope or something right there, and that's what you're supposed to do. And this is just to throw you off. I'm holding. What? It's, yeah, it's not giving me the option. I'm missing, I'm missing something here. try jumping to the right instead of straight ahead. Yeah, that could be. Let's do it. Gotta try something. Nope. Can't you go fully around that branch? No, I've tried. But if you look, uh, there's a giant root to the right and to the left it like it's all uh, like there's a log there or something and I can't oh from the Venus fly trap that's a possibility yeah let me try that nope doesn't give me the option <laughs> Definitely not supposed to go up. But yeah, I can't go I can't go that way. You feel like you just dropped down the wall? Well man, I don't know. Feeling much better. Thanks. Like you know, if there was something to drop from typically in a different spot, there would be like a there would, you know, you'd hit B and you'd latch, you'd grab on afterwards. I don't see anything like that. I don't know if I, I don't think I can fall down to that branch. I need like some uh, macro binoculars. That's what Cal should get. No, you can't make it. You're supposed to just climb down, then across. What the heck? Then why is it stopping me?
<laughs> why game why Oh, they're leaving it, huh? <laughs> Merv says, Kylaris, your thoughts? Um, I don't get this game. <laughs> I just see repeated jumping and falling all the time. I can't, yeah, I don't know what to do here. Stay on the Raccoon far says, left side when going down. Um, um yeah. So I, I can try that. But at some point, I just I just did that a little bit when I you like start to hit these roots and then I can't go down any farther and I have to angle it. See, they're going to hit me. Dang it. Throw me a it shouldn't it shouldn't be this hard, you know. I tried to go left. Yeah, I can't. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, and they're coming for me. I almost hit that, like, um, root that's down there. wonder if I can drop down to that. Nope, I fall off. I might, honestly, guys, I might look this up because I, I'm running out of stim packs. Uh, try hitting drop, then holding down the L1 or whatever helps you grab the wall when you jump. Yeah, I've been doing that. I've been doing that. And um, that was, uh, this was uh, basically my ex entire experience with Fallen Order. <laughs> right? I'm convinced that's why it's called Fallen Order, because you just fall constantly. It's fair. What map is this again? This is uh, Kashyyyk Shadowlands. See, even on the map, it breaks that up as two separate panels. <laughs> hey, Locke. How's it going? There's something simple we're missing. I don't remember it being this hard. Yeah. Perfect. I, well, I, I would think it would be as easy as dropping, right? But that's not working. And I can't go left or right. Oh, your internet's oh, so fast? Oh, you got a new combo of situations, right? Awesome. I hope it yeah. stays stable for sure. How are you doing, Locke? And Naza, how are you doing? What's going on? How's the foot injury? All right, we're going to do this again. Like, for real, man. <laughs> Am I supposed to fall and it, like, punts me over to the side? BD, help, please. I got nice one shot. more stim, you guys. You go down around the root. You're supposed to, you're supposed to let go and re-grab after the root. Well, so, so Dan, I tried going around. I can't. It's like stopping me. And I've tried letting go, but I'm doing okay. The bruising is starting to clear up, which is good. Absolutely, Naza. Hopefully it's feeling better. Yeah, we can't go that way. We tried, we tried going that way. And it just like here it stops me and I got to move. I got to move. I got to move. I got to move. And here it stops me. I'm I'm hitting L uh yeah, left uh trigger. I just saw a video you're supposed to let go and re-grab after the root. Uh raccoon, do you did they say where exactly on the root? 
By the way, fun fact, I say root as rut. R like no, no, root. You say root. root. Makes me ill. Uh, typically, and um, yeah, Kylaris doesn't like it. And it's 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 the wrong thing to say anyway. So I. <laughs> the video says that maybe you just suck at grabbing the vine. Uh, the vines, lol. <laughs> har har raccoon. Well, aren't I supposed to hit uh, left trigger? Like I'm supposed to hit left trigger. Like watch. Left trigger. Left trigger to climb. I'm hitting left trigger. Holding down left trigger. <gasps> no, you guys, we had it! Oh, great timing. Oh, great timing. <gasps> Come on! I'm trying to... No more stimmies. Nope, this is it. Okay, I'm gonna go down. I'm gonna go all the way over here so there's plenty of vine. I'm gonna let go and I'm hitting the flipping button. I think you need to be more to the right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, how about I just. <laughs> I've done it like so many times now, I'm like tripping up. This might be it, you guys. This might be it. Yes! Go, go, Cal. Go, Cal. We finally made it. Yeah, yeah, yes. Can I get some cheers in chat, uh, please? Oh, because yeah. that, yeah, yay. Yeah. Even Cal looked, uh, you know, like, like, come on, man. That was rough. If I get knocked off of this thing, yep. If I get knocked off of this thing by those stupid plants, I'm gonna be real upset. What was that? Enemy! Enemy here! Oh! Oh! There's a guy with a rocket launcher! You save but can. I'm gonna let the force and the force is with me. <laughs> Let's get back on patrol. Oh, need to save, but can't. I am one with the force, and the force is with me. That's awesome. Oh, man. I'm just so good at grabbing vines, Naza. Just so good. Yeah. Like, Raccoon, for real, did it show them grabbing the vine farther down there? Or, like, like, like not grabbing the vi vines up top? Oh. I'm really annoyed by that. I don't know what the actual... <laughs> Wasn't that fun? Let's do it all again. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, it saves my... Like, the chests I get and everything, right? Does it? I mean, let's go check. Let's go chest. Orin versus Giant Root Round 2. Fight. <laughs> I hope it goes better than Orin versus Murder Goat. Yeah, okay, good. Murder Goat. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was ridiculous. And Orin versus... Shelob and Orin versus the <laughs> tongue lizards. <laughs> that's that's weird. Yikes. 
Oh, this is the... Yep. <laughs> yeah, the underwater breather is so cool. Cataclysm comes to mind. Cataclysmic. What, like when you watch the WoW Cataclysm trailer for the first time, and then it turned out to not be that cool? Yeah, everybody was like, can we just get the old WoW back? What? What is this text? But I digress. Oh. He mad at me. You gross. But Dan, remember watching it for the first time, like with us at the townhouse? And we we're all like, oh my gosh, that's a murder. yourself a headache that's cool what I like a murder goat slug yeah yes it's exactly like a murder goat slug that like pukes everywhere that's weird sure is I believe so Dan BT Dub, the food you guys have been posting. Oh my gosh, looks so good. You guys are on a roll. Yeah. Oh, oh, that reminds me, I never posted the recipes from Sunday. I should be working on that. Oh, if you, I mean, you don't have to, otherwise we can do it like, um... <laughs> what? What? Did you say, okay, I won't? Yeah. Why, what were you gonna say? I was just gonna say, we can probably do it on, um... Uh, Thursday on our day off. I kind of just it's like mind after I post the pictures. All right, here we go. <laughs> Team Foodie in the chat. You guys. It could have been mine. It should have been mine. I'm so mad at this part right now. Ugh, to leave in it, huh? Bailey, BC, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Welcome to the common room. I'm Oren. Hi, Laris. And tonight we are falling a whole lot in Jedi Fallen Order. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, I oh. hope you stay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Ugh, Dan, for real, dude. I. This is really teeing me off. I'm about to look it up and be like, what the heck? That's it. I didn't jump. I didn't jump. I just fell. And then I got the option to um, grab the... You have got to be kidding. Um, I, uh, I just walked off. Right there. Right there. Didn't you always give me a hard time about that? Just I'm walking off ledges? <laughs> yes. All right, cool. Good, good, good. Let's go fight some stormtroopers. I hear their aim is impeccable. <laughs> yeah. So I've I've always wanted to talk about that with everybody. Uh, and oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> like, like Obi-Wan even says, you know, and, uh, and these uh, blast points, not as random or clumsy. <laughs> Uh, as Jawas, you know, only Imperial Stormtroopers are, are that precise. Okay. Right. And yet, why can't they hit anybody ever? Yeah.
Okay. <sighs> Actually, the rocket guy kind of helped me. He took out uh, the other guys I was fighting, so. What's that? Oh my gosh. It wasn't the Inquisitors. It wasn't what awaits at the end. It was one little vine wall on Kashyyyk that did him in. Yep, that was it. That's where I quit the game. And thus ends our Jedi Fallen Order series. Wait, 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 that's the only this segment. Get ready to force push. Oh, good. Thanks, Murph. It's three months of streams with him attempting that part. Yeah, yeah, no. Nope. <laughs> part 394. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, and 387 of them are me just uh, falling at the vines. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for Sherlock. <laughs> that is graphic. Oh, I see what goes on here. What do we have here? Three hundred and ninety-four. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it wasn't a random number. I watched a video today about how, uh, like, the differences between Snape in the movies and in the books. It was, it was good. What you got there? Valerian wisdom. I can't talk about it that much in case Prof washes the VOD. Oh, that's true. It's been. He, you guys, it's been he's at least watched through Goblet of Fire now. <laughs> Naza. He's trying to catch up on the story. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's been old lady from Titanic. It's been 84 years. <laughs> That's perfect. Everyone just saw a meme in their mind. Like, yes, he has. He uh, he's watched up to Goblet of Fire, and he was talking with us about it. Um, so he doesn't actually know what happens in the rest of the story. So uh, we're not going to talk about important things. So, I could dive and go into that cave, or I could take the vine. Cave doesn't seem like it's very big. Yep. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's not canon, but it's hilarious. <laughs> Remember <laughs> in the theater, we're like, what? Apple's the, Apple's the waiter? waiter. Read on the Wookiee General's position. For real? Closing. We just busted out laughing. A squad tracking the partisans and Wookiees. They're coming for Tarful. Ooh. Ant-Man dies at the end of the Deathly Hallows. <laughs> That's okay, Naza. Everyone knows that. <laughs> we died. So did Batman, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Naz. I hate these plants. I'm assuming I have to go down and they're going to make me fall. Yep. The heck, man. Oh, you know what? I'm not going to grab that. I'm gonna grab that. Oh, I can go up. What if I want to go down to those? Mm hmm. I got you, Murph. Oh, I see it. Oh, dumb. Yep. Why did it have to be plants? I'm going to go in that water in a second, but first. Well, I was going to look around, but that's apparently as far as I can go. I know, for real. I'm gonna wake up in a cold sweat yelling. <laughs> Grab the route! Jump! I'm putting my hair up. What you got there? 
Peace and justice. How is Cal talking through that rebreather? The vines, the vines. <laughs> yeah. Hey, brutal. We're uh, we're doing really good. How are you? What is going on? Kylaris is bald next stream. I know for real. My gosh. No. <laughs> oh, no, the vines. I imagine I it like a la Steve Carell. Uh, you know. In in his what? Like like doesn't he do something where he like in his sleep? I feel like I remember. I don't know if it was from Get Smart or. Oh. oh. He wakes up and he's like, I'm, I'm fat! fat. <laughs> yeah. That's how I'd wake up and yell vines. Now I have to change the emote side to bald Laris. <laughs> no, no, no. Also, you should, we should tell my oh. joke from dinner. <laughs> uh, I mean, it was Greg. Oh, up. I don't remember how it went. You're going to have to tell it. So, Matt left the room. And I was I was explaining to Emily why he needed to have a haircut and because he was getting really shaggy and she's like, no, he's not. He looks fine. And <laughs> well, over the course of explaining why I decided to that if he if Oren had a villain name, it would be Voldemort with a B. And then she's like, should we tell him? Maybe we shouldn't tell him. Let's keep it a secret. <laughs> <laughs> but we ended up telling him anyway. And it was Voldemort. And then he was like, haha, very funny. And then I said he was, you who must not be shaved. Going up. Yeah. But that one got her. When I said he was, you must not be shaved. She was like, she couldn't hold that one back. Brutal, what's going on with you? How you doing? Couldn't pull that vine? Come on, Cal. Do you think the Empire would have come after Kashyyyk so hard if we hadn't intervened? The Jedi are supposed to be symbols of hope, but I led the Inquisition here. Mari and Tarful put their trust in me. Did I just endanger them again? Yo, safe, safe spot, you guys. It's a safe spot. Just don't slip and get an eyebrow. <laughs> he shall, he who shall not have hair. No, I'm not. I know, for real, Murph. Yay, save. <laughs> See if we can buy a skill. There should be level two skills going on. Uh, howling push, a powerful push allowing Cal to send groups of enemies flying and knock down large targets. I might want that. Uh, the, po you? the power of friendship. Isn't that a My Little Pony reference? I don't know, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? You like Baptiste? Oh, Baptiste oh, is cool. Okay. okay, I haven't, like gotten the hang of him i mean kind of i just don't know if i like his style but that's cool you guys lightsaber throw i'm gonna get lightsaber throw why don't i already have lightsaber throw <laughs> oh because i gotta spend three three points to get it lightsaber throw cal throws his lightsaber forward before pulling it back to him hitting any enemies along the way hold left trigger and why ah What's not to like? And I, that's awesome. An airborne attack that allows Cal to push away nearby enemies when he lands. Ooh. Cal can perform another powerful attack after an overhead slash. Meh, I don't use the Y as much as I probably should. Throws the double-bladed lightsaber in an area around Cal. What? I bet it's useful. Uh, 
uh, Cal's maximum life is increased, and Cal recovers additional life when using a stim canister from BD1. Okay, so here's what I'm uh, here's what I'm deliberating between. I'm I'm either thinking increased stim uh, return, maximum life, or uh, um, howling push. What do you guys think? I tend to go for stat increasing stuff first. Um, but I like the sound of Howling Push. It actually has a sound. I guess. Kel's got a ooh. Really <laughs> that like. I don't vote. Right, yeah, yeah. What do you guys think? Let's get flashy. What's that? What does that mean? I'm assuming that means Howling Push, but... Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm going to go Howling Push. Ooh. I like it. Naza, you waited until I picked one to do that. Naza's like, I think the Stim one. <laughs> you don't know that. Oh, lock, but like, it helps me stay alive. If I'm dead, who cares if I can do a trick? That's literally me telling you to save our boat every second in Sea of Thieves. Who cares if you killed them if we're dead? Right, that's true. Oh, come on, I blocked. They can't do anything if you're good at the blocks and dodges. That's fair. But am I? That's the question. Stormtrooper Commander. Uh, commands nearby stormtroopers allowing focused and synchronized fire on targets equipped with grenades. Stormtrooper commanders lead their battalions into combat for the Galactic Empire. Recruited from countless systems, they've been trained to support the oppressive power of the Imperial War Machine. Their strategy and proficiency with an array of weapons allow them to coordinate attacks, command group maneuvers, and launch deadly assaults. Ooh. Very nice. How come Kashyyyk in this game looks so much more, like, post-apocalyptic? I don't think this looks post-apocalyptic. I think it just, it's... I like gray and gritty. Yeah. Whoa. Oh. Here comes... That's somebody this? evil. A Brock of Scrap Rat playing Jedi. I told the Grand Inquisitor you wouldn't be stupid enough to show your face here again. Especially after we wiped out that feeble resistance. <sighs> Love it when I'm wrong. Is this what you were talking about, Murph? Am I... Oh, oh. I thought I was going to have to push something. Kel's so like X Games. Yeah. What? Hang on. Good vines. Where am I supposed to go from here? I go down? Yep. That's horrifying. This is awesome.
Oh no! Oh, Oren! Come on! Hey man, come on. Let's do this. What? The music is great though, am I right? Ben said that his gym teacher played some Star Wars main theme music while they played a game of like kicking soccer balls that were supposed to be asteroids Aww. and blue hoops that were planets or something. I'm like, that's pretty awesome. What is that thing? <laughs> the Knights. I should call. On second thought, she listens to their transmissions. Better find out on her own. Ooh, Kale's still mad. Right? I was like, you have to tell dad that. Yeah, I thought that was really cool. The kids have some really good teachers this year. Pretty, We're pretty happy with who they got. Um, and Emmy, Emily really likes her gym teacher, uh, her, her physical ed. Uh, and this year she moved to like um, STEM and we were kind of sad about that and it was a, a new teacher doing uh, phys ed and um, it turns out he's a really great teacher too and she still gets to see the the uh, her, you know her her favorite it's like her favorite teacher uh, from from phys ed last year she gets to see her every week for STEM so kind of a cool win-win Yeah. Yeah, we were watching like a like an introduction video for the school year. Cut out before the school year started, and it was all like the special class teachers introducing themselves, and then there was like a a different person that was like, "And I'm going to be your gym teacher," and we were like, <gasps> "We yeah, hadn't yeah. seen her yet." And then the one that she likes popped up and was like, "And I'm going to be your STEM teacher," and we're like, "Shoot, that was a close one." We had a moment. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Sounds good, Naza. Hey, buddy. Thanks for coming and hanging. Hope you have a good one. Hope your class goes well, too. Yep. See you later. <laughs> you're working out while you're underwater with headphones. Uh, headphones on is probably going to make you. Yep. Uh, I hate those spiders. What you doing this time, Dan? More four mil. <laughs> I'm just gonna start with. Get it. It's gonna start with full. So why not? I haven't killed anything yet. Yes. He's trying to beat my steps. And here I am sitting. Come on, I dodged. Two of them. Now there's two of them. The steel's getting worse. Uh -huh. I don't remember. There's three of them. What is this poop? Much more worse. Ha! 
Ah, <laughs> brother! I hate the wildlife on Kashyyyk. It sucks. Dang it. No, 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 go, 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 go. It's over! I have the high ground! <laughs> you know what? Oh boy. That was like the, uh... What was that show with the slow motion sword jumps? Oh, uh, Legend of the Seeker. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's stupid. Hi. That's what I wanted to happen. Blow up. Hey, Ed, how's it going? Hey. What is going on, buddy? Oh, I hate that thing. Right here, BD. Oh, yeah. I forgot you watched that with us. Didn't we? Or not? She watched it as well, but I don't think we watched it with her. Oh, she watched it like simultaneously? Yeah. yeah. She read the books that it was based off of. Seriously though, Dan, do you remember like it was always like he was slow motion leaping off of things? Everything. With his sword. Every chance he got. <laughs> You jerk! Oh no. Nice! That's awesome, Ed. You gonna stream it? I hate the spider. I hate the spider. They're the worst. He dodged! I gotcha. That's fair. Dude, you should totally stream uh, stream it, though. I loved Donkey Kong Country back in the day. 
great game. Wait, what, Ellie? Said I know Ben would watch it. Oh yeah, for sure. And then continue to beg us to get a switch. Yeah. <laughs> What a jerk. Oh, they can't get up the branch. Anything new, says Raccoon Thief? Are you just checking in? Uh, we haven't gotten anything new yet. We got up the vines. Oh, dang it. Hey, BD. What you going to scan, BD? Probably a plant. Wiki horn. A hand carved ru rushier horn inlaid with precious metals and stones. The in intricacy of the design suggests it was owned by a Wookiee of great importance. Interesting. I bet it would. I'm sorry, Dan. I didn't have. I don't think I had enough for force throw. Oh, there's a chest down there. Hold on, I keep hitting the wrong button for that. So I could go two different ways. But I want that chest. <laughs> Whatever, Dan. There was something in there. New Poncho Rover. Eh, I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna keep the Poncho off for now. What was that? I think Chris is gonna like this one. Let's just hope it doesn't get too tall. Mush. Something. Go this way. Ew, look at all the eggs. Look at all the spider eggs. It's disgusting. The stormtrooper was dragged here by some type of creature. And scary out there, BD. Kashyyyk Wildlife, a trooper helmet, the remains of a stormtrooper whose body was dragged up here by Kashyyyk Wildlife. Uh, made me think of the Ewok movies for some reason, all those eggs. I don't remember the Ewok movie as much. I kind of, I kind of remember the eggs, but... Wrong button again for the map. Okay, so there's a way to jump on that and go up. Ed, have you streamed any of the Donkey Kong Country remake game? Because again, I'd watch that. I was going to miss it. For generations, the Wookiees made a pilgrimage to the top. The tree guided them. Hmm. Sacred tree. It is more than a tree. It's a sacred source for the planet. It gave the Wookiees guidance. So, like, I think the lore has established that the, the Wookiees have sort of an innate force sensitivity as a species doesn't necessarily mean they would all be powerful enough to um all become jedi or anything like that but then you know all the wildlife on kashyyyk um you know would have been it would have made it very strong 
in the force. Um, where do I go from here? Where do I go? Uh, I guess just that way. Is there any other way down or across? Nope. <laughs> there are some intense moves there, Cal. Uh, first stream was Donkey Kong Country. I'd be continuing from that point. It's really far to the next save point from where I got to, and I've been avoiding cheating uh, with suspend points. Gotcha. Hey, Dan, you know what would be really good right now? Force throw. I hate this thing. What I wanted to happen. <laughs> bah ha ha, force throw. <laughs> That's green slime. I didn't, uh, I was too busy looking down below here. I'm, I want to check down below here really quick. Just to make sure I'm not missing anything. Because you know me. I'm a completionist. Nope, not a dang thing. You guys, so far, even though it's been challenging, which I've said in the past, I'm not opposed to challenge. Uh, I really like Kashyyyk. Is a lot of fun. Shh. We all know if it's friendly. <gasps> That's the thing that took down the night sister. I think it's huge. I have a feeling that I'm going to run across the ninth sister in this again. I've got two achievements left on this game. Oh, really? Wow. You've, uh, you've got quite a few secrets then, huh? Just yelled, Duncan Hines! <laughs> Duncan Hines! My friend, as Tarful led us here, he spoke of a glorious creature called the Shieldbird. Shieldbird. Oh, here, here's his full thing. My friend, as Tarful led us here, he spoke of a glorious creature called the Shieldbird. He said the bird is the forest protector, so rare it's nearly legendary. I would dearly love to research this creature further, but the Astrium must be my priority. I hope to one day return and search for the Shio with Tarful. And we just saw it. 
Ah, uh, gotcha. That's fair. I actually like that in games. I like that in this game even. Like, um, I've appreciated that. That as I gain more skills and things, I'm able to reach more things. Maybe I'm a glutton for punishment that way, but... Oh, I'm gonna get double jump! I'm If I can actually do it. <laughs> Come on, Oran! Nope. Ah, oh, the Leva. Stupid. Here we go. Try again. You just keep failing, Master. Do you? Good. Keep failing. Keep getting back up. That is the only way to succeed. Do not allow yourself to be weighed down by ego and pretense. Let go of what you fear to lose and rise up. Now. Again. Yes. Good. Now reach my position. You can do it. <laughs> Perhaps I chose the wrong pattern. Oh. I'm only joking, Cal. Don't focus on the opinions of others. Oh. It's a weakness your enemies can exploit. Don't let yourself get discouraged. I gotta not hit it so soon. There. We go. Just gotta keep getting back up. Just gotta keep getting back up, BD. I just gotta keep getting back up, BD. As long as we get back up, we're still in this fight. I'm finally back to where I was before the purge. <sighs> Brother! Our master to Paul died. Okay, I'm hitting it too soon. I gotta be. There we go. Okay. Yes. Double jump. I feel like I have just about everything I need now. Yes. Meditation spot. New skills are available. Stand back. Cal has healed his connection with the Force. Yes. Oh, isn't that nice? So nice. Ooh, BD1 stim canisters completely refill. Yeah, it's three points, though. That's lightsaber throw. Lightsaber mastery. Increase all lightsaber damage. Nice. Well, there's nothing that takes one point any uh, anymore, so That's all I'm going to do for now. Yeah, double jump is awesome. Oh, hold on. I was going to rest. I might as well. Yeah, it seems cool. I mean, like, I'm hoping at this point that I can just get everything. Oh, no. Bye. 
Hmm, listen to that music change. What the heck? It's hurt. Think we can help it? Yeah, screen ah. stuff. Whoa! I understand now. This tree connects the core of the planet. Old friends met here, the Jedi Eno Cardova and Wookiee Chieftain Tarful. They shared a great respect for each other. I should do that more often. Scan, yeah. Find something? Michael. Be wary of sweeping attacks, utilizing the opportunity to counter if parried. Uh... Close the distance by pulling them in using the force. The menacing Mycol is an opportunistic flying predator known for sweeping attacks from the sky. Long considered a delicacy among Wookiee elders which maintained equilibrium within the species, their numbers have flourished under imperial occupation. A nimble aerodynamic acrobat, the creature instinctively avoids retaliation from prey with a balance of cunning, uh, cunning grace and deadly skill. Nice. Speedy, let me see. In my head, I just called the my call Michael. <laughs> Let's go help. If there's nothing else here. Okay, why didn't Kale grab that? Oh, we're climbing the great tree. Holy smokes. The origin tree. gonna get it Mikey I want that echo I also want that chest Ooh. hello what have we here hey, BD, what's this? what is it BD free Kashyyyk new poncho nope Still not a fan of the ponchos. Whoa there, Cal. Whoa. It's a bandolier. This fell from a Wookiee as they climbed the tree. Some type of test. Wookiee Rite of Passage. Wookiee warriors scaled this tree to great heights as a rite of passage. Dropped this bandolier. That's not so good. Yeah, I just don't like the ponchos very much, and I feel like it's kind of a lame way of customizing Cal's appearance. I feel like there's other things that could be done with that. I don't totally hate it. It's fine, but... He totally hates it. I totally hate it. I just don't like how they look. That is a dangling branch. <laughs> oh my gosh. like kale and the beanstalk yeah okay hold on you felt like they fit a scavenge scavenge motif yeah i yes. i can see that pilot new outfit pilot um 
I have formerly hot apple cider. It's now room temperature. Yeah, I don't really hate the ponchos. I just, you know. Oh, nice. Oops. Talk. Catch. Talk. I'm going to say talk. The Tok is a tree-dwelling primitive native to the planet Kashyyyk. These friendly creatures can often be found on the ground searching for overripe fruits. Tok like Bach. Yeah. Mock. Oh, the Lauren. It would have been nice if it was still hot. Uh, I also have cold in the fridge. I have all the ciders. It's almost fall, y'all. That's just dumb. I was, I was, what? Yeah, okay. I was going to be mad if I fell again. I have an ice uh, flavored water. Delicious. Ice flavored? Oh, oh. ice flavor. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. It's called that. From the Clone Wars. Everything we did, did any of it matter? Oh, there's another rope. I'm oh. This is cool, man. Getting up this tree. Hmm. That sounds very imperially. Oh, meditation. Oh, hey, it's a safe spot. Good. That means we're probably getting into something a little hairy. Yeah, the, um sparkling ice caffeine in a can this is the blue raspberry it's really good is there like something down there Yeah, looks like that's the way to go. Mm-hmm. This bird might be the last of its kind. Yikes. This bird may be the last of its kind. The others are long gone. What? I, ha I hate, like extinction stories like that. That's terrible. You think death is down there? Oh, I see what I gotta do. I think down there is only what you take with you. I gotta double jump. Remember to double jump, Orin. Come on, ach, the leva. It's not like letting me double jump. In my head, you just said, extinction's bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I think you'll take everything with you if you fall. <laughs> Why am I not double jumping? Because you don't like to play Genji. Oh, <laughs> so fair. I'm hitting the flipping button. I'm hitting the button. The button. The button. Ugh, the Leva. 
Oh, I hated the Genji. I'm not going to get it because I'm not high enough. I'm, I'm really frustrated by this right now, you guys. I had no idea. <laughs> I got so far! A little healthier. I tried so hard and got so far. Yes, finally. Oh no, the bird. No, don't die. Don't die, bird. Heal it, Cal. Heal it. I can help it, but we have to be careful. I don't want to spook it. Hey, it's okay. We're not here to hurt you. We, we don't want to spook it. Hey, friends. It's okay. It's a piece of the Night Sister's ship. We need to remove it. It's gonna hurt, okay? I'm sorry. Thanks, BD. Here you go. Right. Oh. <laughs> least we could do. Shield birds are so rarely seen that they were once thought to be creatures of legend. The shield's body shape and feathers enable it to glide across long distances without expending much energy. Since the shield conserves energy so well, it rarely leaves its nest. Experts say a typical adult may hunt once per week. Their diet of slags and y shocks led to its depiction as a pre protector of both the Wookiees and Rushire forests. Catching a glimpse of the shield is a rare blessing that guarantees peace for the viewer. Huh. <laughs> Dan. You want to scan, BD? Find something? <laughs> My friend, never have I seen a view more exquisite than atop this tree. My friend, never have I seen a view more exquisite than atop this tree. The climb has given me time to reflect. It was the will of the force that I found Bogano, and that I am here now. There is a greater journey ahead. This is fun. <laughs> oh, good. I love the story. Every check time you say the climb, I hear you sing it and it's my in my head. I wish it would stop, but it won't. Ooh, I like that a lot. Picking it. Gonna go up by the bird again? It was like a jumpy thing. We're gonna ride on it, you guys. <laughs> what? They're giving us a lift. Okay. Let's just take a second, though, and look. At this view, I think that's this where we. I know. Look at this view. That is incredible. I think that's where we started before. 
which is just a cool detail. And then we ha traveled all through the Shadowlands below. That is just incredible. Time to fly. <laughs> Um, barf? But really cool in game form. But I would never do this. But there's still so much the Empire hasn't touched. Cool. That looks really cool. Mm hmm. If there was a green screen and it was snurt, you wouldn't be able to see it. Yeah. The Jedi's lunch <laughs> just fell to the Shadowlands. So true. Justice, new lightsaber sleeve acquired. Good job, BD. Uh, color. Still just got that emitter. I don't know what new ones I have, but that's. Check out the new. Animals. Check out the new what? Animals. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, see, I still like. This one. Which? It's injustice. I think I just got that. I don't mind that. That's kind of cool. Did someone say DK Justice? I like Valor and Wisdom too as well. Still like the one that we have selected. Okay, I don't really like that one. I think I'm gonna either stick with the one I've got or or use Valor and Wisdom too. I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna stick with that. New alloys. We got a whole bunch of stuff. So, just the alloy metal. That's my Guido campaign. Matte. Electrum plated. That's kind of epic. That's, that's crazy. <laughs> Copper, pure steel. We've had dunium. Dunium. Duralium. Eh, I don't really like that. Bronzium, I don't really like. Whoa. Rhodium? That's nuts. I literally, I literally didn't read it at first. I thought you were like karate um. Karate um. Hey, raccoon. Uh, Cerakote. Durite. Osmeridia. See, I don't really like any of those more than the one I have. I'm just gonna keep it out is.
Cool. <laughs> Karate, um... Yeah. For something? I said karateum, and that's how I read it in my mind. What is this? At last, I found my quarry. The Astrium. Used by the Cepho sages millennia ago. I hold in my hand a piece of galactic history. I will never be able to thank Tarful enough. <laughs> Do you know what this means, my friend? No need to return to Darthamir. Darkness clouded every attempt at finding the Astrium inside Kujit's tomb, but the Force... The Force has provided a new path. Kujit's tomb. On Cordova's journey to Kashyyyk, he met with Chieftain Tarful, who knew of an ancient artifact atop the origin tree. Cordova scaled the massive origin tree where he discovered one of the last remaining Zepho Astriums. With the Astrium, he was able to access the vault on Bogano and hide the holocron. Uh, more entries on Cordova's journey. My friend, I have found my quarry atop Kashyyyk's origin tree, the Astrium. This relic is the key to the vault on Bogano. The dark side clouded every attempt at finding one on Dathomir. The forest provided a new path. This Dathomir is crazy. Hmm, I wonder what one we got for this. Maybe it was Tarful. A symbol of Wookiee resistance, Tarful leads his fighters against the ruthless Imperial op occupation of their homeworld. Forced into hiding deep in the forest, he evades enemy capture, striking out from secret locations by employing asymmetrical warfare. When Cal learns Cordova and Tarful were close friends, he begins a desperate hunt to find him and learn crucial information in his quest. Uh, I figure that's probably what he did. Anyway... Uh, we are gonna save. Remember when you were on a work call today and you said something was electronic? Yes. <laughs> yes. I just thought of that. I mean, I realized immediately that that was the dumbest, one of the dumbest things I've ever said. But <laughs> that was great. Just a little tired. Hey, bird. Hey. Hey, bird. I know you love raccoons. Who doesn't love raccoons? They're pretty great. I don't know. <laughs> not, not really enough to steal one. <gasps> I hate the ninth sister. Done hurting this world. I don't know what's got second sister thinking you're so important. She likes her souvenirs, but oh, it's your I'm fault. not in it for the memories, and honestly, you're not worth my time. So let's make this quick. Slow, but really tough. Oh, yeah, that hurt. Riz. 
Hey, Riz. How's it going? <laughs> Sorry, I can't stay and watch the stream, but I gotta go. So have a great rest of your day. And Riz, thanks for yeah, thanks, by. Riz. Appreciate it. Oh, the Leva. Okay, come on. BD, here. The second sister sucks. No train. Ninth sister. Second sister. Is that from something else? No, that's that's this game. Oh, it's been so long, I forgot. BD. Get over here. We're not done. Oh, you guys, this is gonna be tough. Just wait. Your last. Come on, Cal. Right here, BD. Get over here. We're not done. Oh, I've got no force. really supposed to, oh, like, kill her? Come on, I dodged. Aren't you enjoying this? Hey, BD. Draw stim. Bring the pain. <laughs> Why do you just no, come on. every practicing for Friday in case you come? We are hoping that some schlock will join us for Overwatch on Friday this week because he has the game now and he's new. Oh gosh. Crack. Can I block that? Need assist. One more stim pack, man. I don't know if I can beat this. <laughs> 
Should have dodged to the side. Let's finish this. Yeah, we're hoping for it also, please. There's like room for all the people that we know at least. I just haven't asked her yet. I don't know if she's gonna You'll die like the rat you are. Yes. Not bad for trash. What about for a Jedi? Is there a difference? Raccoon said I only dodge when she's attacking, otherwise I'm attacking. Mm-hmm. What? How is this a she? I, she's not human. Oh, scared of me too. No, well, still. Time to oh. cry. Oh. Don't you think? Oh, I can't block that. I'm gonna die. I got no stim packs. This is it. Gotcha. Am I gonna have to redo that whole thing? Uh, RP Gamer 107, thanks for the follow. How are ya? Welcome to the common room. I'm Orin. And we just died to the ninth sister. Whew. What is this we? Oh, redoing that whole thing. I gotta take her down completely? Whew. I don't know, man. I mean, I'm gonna have to. Good, I'm glad. That's cool. What are you up to besides uh, hanging on Twitch? Oh. That was, man, that put me through the paces. <clears throat> I gotta watch the, the Shiyu, Shiyu, whatever, die again. Okay, good, I don't. Come on, I blocked. That's one for me. Scared of getting burned? What? Why am I not blocking? And I feel like she changed direction like mid swing. I like that. Oh, move, Cal. Is gonna love it. Right, yeah, for sure, Raccoon. I should have used a stem. I should have backed off. Man, this fight is tough. And I only have it set to Jedi Knight. I hit it. I hit it on Jedi Master earlier. Can you imagine? I know, I should have used one. I should have backed off and used it. I didn't even think about it. I was kind of going on the attack this time, where last time I was playing a little more defensively. And I wasn't doing enough damage. And I ran out of stims. And, um... Yeah. This took forever on Master. I believe it. Hey, Misty! Thanks for popping hey. in. Hope you have a good night. Nice, cool. Thank you. Yeah, thanks for stopping by, guys. I'm going to give it one more go, and then um, if I don't beat it this time around, then uh, I'm, I'm going to call it for tonight. But I... I'm in so much trouble. Oh, holy cow, I got a uh, an achievement, and it totally made everything lag for a second. 
How come I'm blocking and nothing's happening, like, for real? And she's changing direction mid flip and jump. I dodged. That's crap. Hey, BD. Scared of getting burned? Can't. Oh, can't block that. Getting frustrated. Is she playing the game or is she watching you? Uh, Kylars is like around for chat, but she's actually playing Overwatch right now. No, oh, you're not? What are you playing? Seas. Oh, nice. You're playing C? I could so use your help right now. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> so slow. Normally, normally we do play together, but this is the one night where yeah. he's playing a solo, so yep. I'm just hanging out. I've been doing, uh, RP, I've been doing a bonus stream of, um, of this game for, like, the last cup model, several weeks. Come on, I gotta dodge later. Up here. I'd be scared of me too. Patched like one hole the entire time I've been playing, but this is the first time I maybe even gonna get a chance. Well, I feel like I'm doing a lot better this time than last time. Oh, crap. Move, move. Stim BD. Oh, come on, come on. Toss me one, BD. Hey, Naza, welcome back, man. Got another spider in your room, Naza. I can't block that. Come on. Not happening. Don't move, Orin. Come on. Gotta, I see you're going red. I gotta. I gotta move. Need assistance. Come on, I don't wanna fight you. Good. I'm out of stims. What? Was I supposed to double jump that? Double jump it. Yeah, that makes sense. Whew. Yeah, we did get double jump raccoon.
Cool, Missy. I hope you guys have a good night. Thanks for coming in. Night, guys. Was that your last chance? Yeah, yep. <laughs> Run! Oh, yikes. Now it's a kill it. Oh my, oh my gosh. You should get in my game. Oh no, it just disappeared. Yes. They just failed me. No. What's happening? I'm getting attacked by bad people. Oh, Ed, nice. Yeah, it's fitting that part nine of your stream series is the ninth sister. Cut in half at the end. Gotcha. It's a Dax shack attack. <laughs> hey, mini Cocoa Puff, how are ya? What is going on? <laughs> if the raid went through, I didn't see it. Uh, it, it must not have worked. Did you raid? Appreciate it. Delax, Hi, 2017. <laughs> Yo, what up? About How's it going? Yeah, unfortunately, it didn't go through. It sucks. It would have been great to see the uh, the notification and everything. Appreciate the raid. That's really cool. How's uh, how's everybody doing tonight? And um, how was your stream? See you, raccoon. Have a good one, buddy. Thanks for coming and hanging. Bye. We'll catch you next time. Nas is going to go sleep on the couch for the foreseeable future. <laughs> oh Did you get the spider? Or is it still there? Blech. Oh, nice. Deluxe rated, and I'm part of the Dax Shack community. Awesome. Well, hey, welcome, everyone. Appreciate you stopping by. Uh, uh, Delax, thanks very much for the, the raid. Really appreciate that. And I'm really sorry that the uh, notification didn't get go through. Um, the last time we, ra we got raided, I thought it worked. So I don't know what's up with that, but um yeah very much appreciate that hope y'all are doing great Delax, how was your stream yeah for sure well and i'm actually i'm using obs studio so i don't know i don't know what's up with that so but uh but yeah i appreciate that uh Delax, what were you playing were you playing um fallen order as well or different game by the way everyone welcome to the channel i'm Oren. She's busy. That's my wife, Kyle sorry, Aris. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> She's fighting in Sea of Thieves right now. So, same game. Nice. Very cool. Oh, gotcha, Naza. Naza, dude, you find that spider, man. <laughs> that's that's creepy, dude. I'm, I had that happened to you here the other day, and you never found it, but yeah. it wasn't probably a horrible red Australian one. Oh, awesome, Deluxe. That's cool. What, uh, what planet were you uh, working on the tomb for? on we're uh we're trying to wrap up Kashyyyk here for the second time our second run through of it and it's been really cool I really I really enjoy Kashyyyk we've been doing the Shadowlands and a lot of fun yeah Naza told you told you that you had to move yeah Naza's in Australia and he tells us about all the dangerous um, all the dangerous creatures that he comes across. Oh, this is your first playthrough? Awesome. Yeah, this is actually my first playthrough as well. Um, I've been kind of doing a, um, a Fallen Order bonus stream series. Uh, so I play every Monday or Tuesday. Um, when, you know, I mean, barring anything that comes up. But, uh, I've, I've played most Mondays or Tuesdays for the last several weeks. And um, I love it. It's a great game. I started it, unfortunately, on Jedi Master and kind of didn't realize it. And I really like uh, I really like the challenge. Um, I don't really mind dying. Actually, it doesn't it doesn't bother me. It just fuels me to keep going and trying. But um, uh, like even this, we were fighting uh, one of the Inquisitors, and I just I don't want to give up. But it's it's almost it's quarter to twelve here, so and I've got work in the morning. But, uh, but yeah, it's just, this is a fantastic game. It's beautiful. The gameplay is fun. I'm, I'm really loving the story. Uh, it's, it's been great. How, how, have, how have you been feeling about the game so far? <laughs> Life in Australia is a ticking time bomb. <laughs> Seriously. If you have so many stories, it is terrifying. It's true. I'm sure it's a lovely place, but I'm not a fan of the creatures. <laughs> 
I'm gonna actually see if there is a record of the raid that I could actually get to play. I just think it's fun. Give me one second. Oh, I love old school Battlefront. I played a ton of Battlefront 1 and then a lot of 2 as well. Like, more than I've even played the recent, the more recent years Battlefronts. Um, but we have played quite a bit of recent Battlefront 2. Oh, yeah. Um, Elax, it, it did not, uh, it didn't even register. The raid, that sucks. I can't even get it to play. The snakes alone, right? Uh, I love it. I went, uh, I went, played through Kotor one and old school Battlefront two, then jumped uh, to this game. Yeah, that's awesome. Um, we definitely uh, started with this community around, centered around the newest Battlefront two. Um, we didn't personally get it uh, right away, probably for the first year, and then we were kind of playing it. Um, we came across our um, our really good friend Professor Plum, who we're part of a stream team, family friendly stream team with. If I can spell, I'd be able to. Why do I keep spelling it with an R? Oh, I, I know. <laughs> oh um, God, it's electronical. <laughs> yeah, uh, but so anyway, so we're we're part of this uh, family friendly stream team and community with um, Professor Plum, and uh, came across his channel, and and we all started playing Battlefront together, and started building our our uh, community through that, and. Um, We've now moved on to uh, some some different games. Uh, we're primarily playing Sea of Thieves and streaming that on Sundays and Wednesdays uh, and some Overwatch on Friday. But Elax, thank you so much for that follow. Really appreciate it. That's awesome. Um, thank you. But yeah, so, uh, so but, but, you know, Jedi Fallen Order is a fantastic game. Got it for Christmas. Mini Coco Puff, appreciate it too. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the common room, you guys. Uh, so we've got a, a kind of, uh, I don't know, loosely themed, uh, loosely Harry Potter themed channel because we're big Harry Potter fans. So love the stories, love the movies. Um, but yeah, uh, so we call it the common room. But um, but yeah, so we, um, we, uh, got Jedi Fallen Order for Christmas and I yeah like I said I've been been doing a series on it it's just so much fun it's such a great game I look forward every week to um to hopping back in and playing it I really kind of wish I had more time to play it but um with our current schedule and we've got some kids uh you know some younger kids that we don't have we don't have the time for more more than that really which, which is unfortunate because it is so much fun Use the Kibo and uh, Kibo and use the electronic oh interwebs. <laughs> my wife and I both stream, but we only have one setup. I do Star Wars and she does Harry Potter. Oh, that's awesome. That is awesome. That's really cool. You know what, Deluxe? I'm going to have to come check out your your stream. Yeah. That's fantastic. Um, so, yeah, that's I, Kai Laris and I basically we, we stream together as well. Um, uh, pretty much always at the same time and um, she's actually on in the same room as me just on the other side of the green screen so we we set it up so that our backs are facing the same green screen and um, we just recently got an Elgato uh, stream deck and we've been able to utilize that to capture both of our um, both of our perspectives when we're playing games so that's pretty cool Yeah. Oh, you're a Hufflepuff? Nice. That's cool. I got mad respect for Hufflepuffs. Mad respect. Yeah, I'm a Ravenclaw too. Nas is a Ravenclaw. Selfish Lock is a Ravenclaw. Yep. You're not spending the points? No. What are you saving up for, Selfish Lock? <laughs> it's just, it's 10 points. Right. <laughs> but, um... But, yeah. Uh... So yeah, just recently we've been able to kind of hook hook the computers up. So we ran a 25 foot um, Cat 7 cable uh, around the the border of the room, so that um, and we got the uh, NDI 
um, plugin for OBS Studio, and that allows us to catch Kylars's um, stream as well. So I can I can control it all from here, and uh, and and say we're playing Sea Thieves or Overwatch. Even we can flip flop between the perspectives. So it's really fun. So it's really cool. Like like uh, I I also have a lot of respect for the um, the husband and wife streaming you know streaming uh uh relationship i guess because we're in it too and that's a lot of fun i think it's really cool to have something like this to share even you know like kyleris didn't join me in streaming for a while uh you know besides kind of the the rare occasion and um starting in like this past march she said i'm all in on game let's do this thing and it's been a lot of fun it's been fun sharing it with her you know i don't feel like i have to split my time I can actually, you know, she and I can actually create a schedule and um, and I, I think it just adds for uh, interesting content, so. Yep. Ravenclaw is the best. <laughs> Ravenclaw, yeah, for sure. I want to make you guys do a food stream on sushi. Oh my gosh! Yes! I want to make sushi so bad! Not my jam. Kylaris doesn't like sushi, <laughs> but I love it. <laughs> that's awesome. I'm hoping we can get to that point soon. Yeah, Deluxe, that's awesome. I, I hope so too. You know what? I, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna come check out your stream. Uh, I'll toss you a follow because uh, I'm really interested. That's really cool, man. Fourteen point six thousand. Nice. It'll be a while. Yeah. I mean. Oh, no. Mini Coco Puff. You are the wife. I didn't catch that part. Is that oh, am cool. I right about that? That's awesome. Nas has twenty thousand. Cool. I talked to Kylaris actually the other day uh, after after the Snurt uh, cooking stream, and I said, "Should we lower the points?" And we're you know because we really like doing the cooking streams, um, and I think it's popular but uh as a concept because we've only done the two so far but um but we're also thinking too at some point people are going to have a lot of points and um and we've already had some people hit that and we don't want to be doing cooking streams like every week um even though they're a lot of fun like it's fun it's a lot of work yeah we put a lot into it You have to try a bunch of different kinds, Kylaris. Yeah, she yeah, just I've tried some kinds. I've tried what's considered like quality and whatever, and I just have never tasted one that doesn't taste like a raw fish, like rubbed in dirt. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thirty-four thousand, really? Wow, that's awesome, Ed. Thank you so much for uh, for watching us that much. Appreciate it. Appreciate the support. Uh. Minnie is is uh, married to Delax. That's awesome, you guys. So do you do you both stream on like are you using different setups, but you're streaming no, from you your own accounts? They maybe have like one gaming situation mm. and they take turns. Gotcha. Maybe kind of like um, Misty and Kyle. Maybe have Yeah. Cool. I'll give you both uh I'll give you both a follow. I'm gonna do that really quick. Um, appreciate you guys coming and following us and gotta start somewhere right yep oh mini you're playing lego harry potter i'm playing that with my kids right now um we had it for xbox 360 and uh our our years five through seven broke and um the kids actually have played through a lot of uh one through four and couldn't move on to five through seven so i just recently bought um with actually points through my work uh, I was able to buy um, the complete collection, and we've been playing through that again. And it's one of one of me and my kids' favorite things to do together. So, that's awesome. Wow, they got married just before um, COVID. Oh, really? Wow. I mean, what a time to be new. Yeah. <laughs> so I mean, old. congratulations on on being with you know in your first year for several months of marriage. That's awesome, and uh, you know. Uh, way to go in getting married just before covid because i think 
COVID has ruined many a, uh, a wedding day. That's true. That's true. So. My sister is actually like a wedding coordinator and she's had quite a year as well. Or at least not much of a year. Oh, I gotta move that. <laughs> That's really That's cool. Quite Eight months of going awesome. We've been married for 14 years. Yeah. Yep. Be uh, 15 in January. Blows my mind. What is that? I know. <laughs> when did we get so old? <laughs> Yeah, that's awesome. Yep, yep, we've been married uh, 14 years. We have a seven-year-old daughter and our son is gonna be five next month, so, yeah. Almost nine already? Wow, that's Dan. Family. I can't believe it's been that long. That's nuts. It doesn't feel that long. Wow. Right. That's pretty incredible. Congrats to you guys next month as well. That's awesome. Two months, but who's going? Delax, I'll tell you. I mean, it, it's it's awesome. I, I'm not gonna lie. Kylaris is my best friend. Um, we spend a ton of time together. Uh, we share, you know, pretty much everything. And um, I couldn't ask for for somebody better to spend my life with. To be honest, if I can get just a little mushy, she's gonna hate it. Look, she's rolling her eyes. She hates it. Oh boy, oh boy here we go. Orange being. <laughs> Or it's being gushy. Uh, yeah, I, uh, but yeah, you know, <laughs> it's it's been fantastic. It's been a great 14 years, and um, you know, it just it really it just keeps getting better. So, yeah. So yeah, excited. Definitely gonna have to um, come check you guys out. So that's really cool. And thank you again so much for the for the raid. That's great. Really appreciate that. Um, and glad you're having fun with this game. Me too. For sure, Dan. I think you found found the right person for you too. Absolutely. So with that, it is just about midnight here, and I've got work in the morning, um, and we got to take our kids to school and everything. So it's going to be an early morning again. But uh, you know, want to say thanks to everybody for coming and hanging with us. Uh, this was so much fun as always. Love this game. Cannot say enough good things about it, um, and just really excited to get back to it next week as well. Um, I should be back with Jedi Fallen Order next Tuesday. I don't think we have uh, anything that would make it Monday. But uh, if you're part of our subscriber Discord, um, I'll post uh, in there when that's coming up. And then uh, I'll also try to update Twitter. Um, my, my Twitter... Uh, let's link that really quick. Uh, I'll also update my Twitter, um, just letting everybody know. Uh, when when we'll be going live with that but i would expect tuesday uh we will also oh go ahead an outro minus the outro you're absolutely correct um so uh we will be back tomorrow night 9 p.m u.s eastern time uh for some more sea of thieves uh our regular wednesday sea of thieves and then we will be back on Friday or uh, some Overwatch. Going to be playing Overwatch with hopefully Professor Plum, uh, Selfish Lock, and our sister in law Mariah. That would be fantastic. That's, the that's what will happen. That yeah. would be really fun to have a five person group for the oh, first man. time. We're gonna we're gonna destroy it. So um, even just like last week, we played with Professor Plum and Mariah, and just being able to communicate in Discord while we're playing Overwatch and everything. It, I, I mean, yeah, we lost some games, but we won way more than we lost, and it, it, they were all really well fought matches. It made a huge difference. So super excited for that. But well, I think they're all called that. Can this episode be called Falling Order? <laughs> Yes, <laughs> I've had I've had uh, play sessions in this where there's been way more falling than today. So, but yeah, Naza, catch you later, buddy. Hope your uh, hope your foot is healing well. Hope you're um, you're back to 100 percent really soon. Glad you could come and hang. Yeah, hope you don't get bitten by that spider. Even though I 
Do spiders bite? I don't think they yeah, bite. Yeah. No, they like release like other, other. Let's acid. Get all Bill Anyways, here. just say. Do bad things. <laughs> right. Yeah. Here. Hopefully you catch that spider and either get rid of it or destroy it. You know. But anyway, just destroy, destroy it. it. <laughs> Kill it. Kill it. Put them all. Um. Once again, thank you to Delax for uh for rating. Oh, I have a notification here. Uh, but I don't know. That's weird. Um, the follows worked. I don't know why the raid didn't, but um. Or he Spider Man. Yeah, right. I don't know if I would test it. I wouldn't. But yeah, thanks again to Delax uh, for rating and for the follows from uh, Delax and Mini Mini Coco Puff. Really appreciate that. So glad you guys stopped in. Definitely going to be checking out your stream. And um, thanks to Naza and Ed and Raccoon and Selfish Lock and all you guys for um, coming and hanging. My mom was in earlier. Always appreciate that. So she's been trying to support us there, especially since she was on our, our uh, cooking stream, which um, if anybody's interested, uh, in the VODs, uh, past broadcasts, we just did a cooking stream on Sunday. Um, we made uh, Dutch pea soup, which is also known as snert or snert. Can't roll the R as well as my dad can. Uh, also known as yerte sop. And uh, yeah, and, and ertve, ertve sop. So okay, it's. Okay, all right. Blah, 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 blah. But, anyways, um, that it was such a fun stream. We had such a good time. The food turned out amazing. Um, and uh, yeah, I would recommend that. The quality, the video quality wasn't where we wanted it, but it was a lot better than the um, Dutch pancake stream and uh, really just couldn't be any happier with it. So, yeah. Wow, you are. What? Long I'm chatty, <laughs> I'm chatty tonight. I don't want to quit. I don't want to quit. It's been so much fun, so, uh, but yeah. I'll most likely become hospital bed man. <laughs> poison guy, poison guy does nothing because he's in bed. Yeah, for yeah, sure, it's Minnie. Really good. Really good to you guys too. For I sure. will have to come check out your stream. Yeah, for sure. All right. Well, hey guys. Hope you all have a great night uh, or day wherever you're at, uh, and we hope to catch you tomorrow. And uh, we'll talk to you later. Bye. Music. <laughs>